Good morning, everyone. Thank you very much for joining me. Today is Thursday, October 24th, 2024. This year's Oride meteor shower has been spectacular. Have you had a chance to see any of the fireballs that have accompanied these uh, meteors? Monday evening was the peak of the Oride meteor shower, which are active between September 26th and November 22nd this year. On the 21st, there was 571 reports of a large fireball that was seen over many states. Connecticut, D.C., Delaware, Illinois, Indiana, Kentucky, Maryland, um, Michigan, North Carolina, New Jersey, New York, Ohio, um, Ontario, Pennsylvania, Virginia, West Virginia, and probably even more over Lake Erie all the way up to uh, Canada there. Here is one image that was submitted to AMS. Also on the same day, I believe it was for the 10th time ever, and the third time just this year, astronomers discovered an asteroid right before it impacted our Earth's atmosphere. The latest was a small rock, they say, perhaps three feet across, one meter in diameter, which preliminarily was named A11DC6D. The Atlas survey briefly tracked the space rock before it harmlessly impacted the atmosphere above the Pacific Ocean. I haven't found any um, images of that. These images that I'm showing you are from that other asteroid on the uh, 21st. NASA's Center for Near-Earth Object Studies reported a fireball at 1054 uh, Universal Time on October 22nd. The energy released from the impact with our atmosphere would have been a little less than the asteroid that hit above the Philippines on September 5th. I reported about that. It was bright. Here's another image. It's not very big. Um, it was submitted. It's a video, a clip from the video from um, AMS. Also, a large communication satellite broke up in orbit, affecting users in Europe, Central Africa, and the Middle East, Asia, and Australia. It adds to the growing number of space junk, junk clouding our planet's neighborhood. The U.S. Space Force is tracking debris in space after a satellite malfunction by Boeing. Um, an unusual event, they're calling it. It exploded earlier this week, the um, satellite operator said. The Intelsat 33E satellite, which was launched in 2016 and provided communication across Europe, Asia, and Africa, experienced an anomaly, they said, on Saturday. Attempts were made to work with Boeing and repair the satellite, but on Monday this week, the U.S. Space Force confirmed that the satellite had exploded. The satellite breakup left some customers without power or communication service. Intelsat said it was working with a third-party provider to limit service interruptions and is in communication with the customers. Uh, power? I thought that was kind of weird. Russian space agency Roscosmos said it had recorded more than 80 fragments from the destroyed satellite. Analysis of the piece's trajectory determined that the destruction of the satellite was instantaneous and high energy, Roscosmos said. I wonder if it was deliberately brought down. What do you think about that? I would like to know. Put your comments down below. There's probably videos on Twitter, different social media about this fireball event that was seen over so many states. Again, this was on October 21st, which would have been Monday. This report here comes from Canada, Ontario, and they said the color was green. Um, they did hear a sound, evidently, too. I heard a bang from my right and saw the meteor breaking into green pieces, uh, maybe five or more. Another report. Now, this one comes from Newton Falls, Ohio. I was facing north, looking up, and there was this scooting across the sky, uh, the neighborhood north 
of me and it seemed to have um, heard the kids outside yelling, shouting, um, so they must have also saw it too. Said the color was light blue, light green, and white. Another report from Litchfield, Ohio said it was very different um, type of fireball that they had seen before. It was very slow. I almost thought it was a flare. The following night, October 23rd, there was 63 reports coming from Georgia, Kentucky, Maryland, North Carolina, South Carolina, Tennessee, Virginia, and West Virginia of another fireball that was seen. This report comes from Waxhaw, North Carolina. They said that it was their third sighting over the past years, all by accident, and did not know about this site. Yeah, you, you, you can report them to AMS, and it really is great when you do it for your meteor, asteroid, things like that report, uh, fireball. Um, yeah, and other people really enjoy reading them. They said the color was orange, yellow, and light yellow. Um, they might have heard a slight whooshing sound. This report comes from Salisbury, North Carolina. Um, been watching the sky in this location trying to see the comet Tukachin A3. We took pictures of our uh, on October 14th and we were surprised and blessed with this sighting. Yeah, I reported about that comet. Um, it's actually Tukachin Atlas. Yeah, it's going to be in the um, night sky um, just before sunset. You can look up the video that I did about that. They said there was a bright flash followed by a three-second bright orange trail. This report comes from North Carolina. I am 63 years old and have seen shooting stars, heard sonic booms, and seen space launches living in Ontario for a few years. But this was by far the coolest and scariest thing that I've ever witnessed in the sky. You know, with the threat of war going on, maybe that's why it was scary. It says also the train looked to be about an inch long from where I was standing. It was bright and orange, uh, the trail was, and only lasted maybe a few seconds and then disappeared it was just a bright big ball of fire then it disbanded looked like um, a much smaller one uh, behind it and then it was gone and just a small trail left behind it and that's evidently when it broke up so were you lucky enough to see this fireball did you hear any sound when it um, broke apart let me know here is the AMS webpage of all the different events. Again, the link will be down below in the information box below this video. So we got one listed for today, which was probably last night. I'll click on that. 17 reports that came in from Connecticut, Delaware, Maryland, Massachusetts, New Jersey, New York, North Carolina, and Virginia. I wonder why that one's hopping. Let's click on it and see what they say. This is from New York. Never seen anything like it before, and I stargaze a lot. Said the color was light green. Uh, no sound. Glowing train that was diminished and thin at the end. And there was a bright flash before it disintegrated. One photo was submitted. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Look at that there. Yes, what else is coming with this latest meteor shower? Then on the 23rd, there was eight reports submitted from Arizona. That would have been yesterday, Wednesday. No images submitted, but they said here it was orange and light yellow. This report came from Tuscan, Arizona. I've seen two green fireballs at the same park different years. So I am familiar with the uh, phenomenon of a large meteor. This was not green. It was very yellow-orange. I would say that a tiny bit more than two seconds. I asked two girls behind me if they saw it, and they casually said yes and walked on. 
this additional remark I have to make about this, really, it was remarkable. The first I've seen, like, it was quite spectacular for not a particularly dark sky. Uh, Tuscan is a dark sky city, but I wasn't, it was, I wasn't that far from Holmes. Thank you for collecting the data. When I'm done, I'll look and see if anyone also reported. Well, you got seven others besides yours. They said it was orange, yellow, fire colored. Yeah, maybe we should go out tonight if you got clear skies and see if you can see anything. It's been really busy this last week with fireballs, meteors, shooting stars, things like that. She also said the terminal explosion was like a very hot coal in your barbecue or when it falls apart. Um, this sounds as though it got very hot and disintegrated. But I, I am sure it disintegrate, disintegrated much like a barbecue coal. I don't know what fragmentation is in the next uh, question. Um, it all hung together with a very bright streak and then uh, disintegrated at the terminal explosion. Yeah, there are some reports from Phoenix, Arizona, Mesa, Arizona. It was a very bright, oh, I was in a very bright place with artificial light. Yeah, soccer field. And they still saw it, so there had to have been other people that saw it. Said the color was yellow. So have you seen any of these recent events during this meteor shower? Put your comments down below. Thank you very much for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. And I'll talk to you later. God bless you. Bye.